Hello everybody, this is a uh, review or an unboxing both of the Apple USB Super Drive. This is for the um, uh, NE 2008 through present time uh, Apple Mac computers that do not have a built in optical drive. So on the back you can show, it shows a little graphic how you plug it in. This is a MacBook uh, Pro. And you, you just plug it into the uh, USB port and you can use it. So, uh, the original release year of this was 2010, and it was called the Apple MacBook Air Super Drive. And then in 2012, they switched it to the uh, USB Super Drive because uh, I believe the Retina MacBook Pros were starting to come out, and those didn't come with optical drives. So we're going to open this up and I'm going to show you what is uh, inside. So get this in camera here. I found this on eBay for uh, $40. This sells on Apple uh, website for uh, $80 and the seller said that he bought this a few years ago to use and he forgot that he bought it. So this is a brand new one. I'm going to assume that this is from 2015-ish. Get the plastic out of the way. So here's the box. Uh, Apple logos on both sides. Graphic on the back. There's product information. So we're going to open this up. For you all. Uh, so the inside has the super drive right here. It's got plastic on it. So I can lift this up and I can move it out of the way. The USB isn't that long. It's about maybe a foot, but that's okay. I don't need it to be long. And in here we have some manuals that I'll look at in a minute. And that's product warranty. And that is all that is in the box. Okay, so I'm going to right now, I'm going to peel off the plastic. Probably goes this way first, doesn't it? So here it is. This has on the bottom of it a rubber foot around it to um, make it stick to the surface and not move as much. It also has a beautiful Apple logo on the bottom. Um, just some stuff. Here's the USB, which USB also has a little plastic on it. Let's peel that off. So this weighs a little bit, probably like two pounds. And there's your, right here is where you insert your disc. So I'm going to put an Apple sticker on the top of it. So it'll have more you know, just make it look a little better. So as you can see, I just put an Apple sticker on top of it to make it just look even better. So right here is the instruction manual for the Super Drive. So as you can see, you plug it into your MacBook. That's a MacBook Air in the picture. And you just put it, um, put your disk in that you want. Um, it could be uh, software, it could be a blank CD to burn music to, or a blank DVD uh, to put um, a video on, or it could be like a movie you want to watch. And it should automatically install drivers, I guess, to work. Now, I will not be using this on a um, Apple computer. I have a laptop I have a laptop right here. I do have a Mac, but there's no OS on it right now, and I do not have another Mac to install an OS on it. So, 
I'll be using it with my computer. So you have to go into Boot Camp. You have to go to the Apple website and download the newest version of Boot Camp. And then you can um, install the drivers needed to use it on your computer. And it's that simple. So now I'm going to be putting in DVD. And hopefully it will work. Hold on. Listen up, I need your ideas now. Ideas, please.